I'm in Brooklyn, New York, on lands stolen from indigenous indigenous tribal nations including the Lenape and Canarsie and in this piece I'll be engaging with music I made when I was an artist in residence at McDowell in what is now known as New Hampshire on land stolen from indigenous tribal nations including the Abenaki, the Penacook, and nations from the Wabanaki Confederacy. Whenever I engage in a act of verbal verbal communication with a new listener or a new audience like you I consider well whether I'm going to whether I'm going whether I'm going to preface the way I speak, whether I'm going to pre-voice the way I speak. I speak with a stutter, and the way the stutter usually manifests is something called a glottal block, which is when there is a stoppage in my speech. In this piece, the stutter is transcribed. The stutter is a musical instrument. I made this music while I was a fellow at McDowell in spring of 2019. I'm listening to it as I speak.
The music you're hearing now, I created using a process called granular synthesis. Using my computer, I took the recording I made at McDowell and split it into tiny snippets of sound. Called grains. I can rearrange these grains to make new music. When I make a piece of music, the music passes through me. It's a seed I plant. The seed grows, mostly unobserved. At a certain point, flowers appear. Them. 
Anthers. The part of the flower that houses. Houses pollen. When I use granular synthesis on the music, it's as if the anther opens, releases the pollen. The sound is carried not by wind or water or mason bee or ruby-throated hummingbird, but by the silence that authorizes and protects all music. What new sounds already live in the one sound? Oh, imminent. 
Hi everyone. Thank you so much for watching Even Song. Please join me tonight at 7:30 as I take over the McDowell Instagram account to go live and have a conversation with McDowell Chair Nell Painter. I'm very excited to speak with her. Again, that's 7:30 tonight at McDowell. 1907. Bye-bye.